So third of our time finals here of the under 18s. 3.39.19 still the time to beat. We've got Melbourne High B, Wesley C, Caulfield A, Scotch B and Xavier A. So we'd be looking here at Xavier and Caulfield potentially as the ones to lead out. Caulfield will change first. Xavier won't be too far behind them. Then on the inside we've got Melbourne High School and also Wesley College. But Caulfield is starting to come through nicely on the second leg of 200 metres. So Caulfield will be leading this. Xavier not too far. They'll be right with them though on the stagger. Scotch are coming through well for a B team as well. So they're in the mix. It's going to be a very tight change over here. Caulfield first. Xavier. Scotch not far behind. A lot will be determined by this next 400 metre leg. And we see Caulfield already is trying to get right out there and establish the lead as they come across on the stagger. So Caulfield will settle in first, Xavier will take second position, about 15 metres then back to Scotch. So just to call for the medalists in the women's under 18 sprint medley final, we have the following school teams please down to the tunnel. Wesley College Team A, Meth Methodist Ladies College Team A and Halebury College Team A. You can make your way down to the tunnel for the presentation, please. So still Caulfield, Xavier, Scotch. Gap back then to Wesley, sorry, Melbourne High School and Wesley. So going into the 800 at 144. So 3.39 is the time they need. So it's going to take about a 155 split to get that. So if we get a split at around the two minute mark, then these guys are in for a chance of a medal. So 3.39 is the gold position at the moment with Wesley, 3.46. So we need a 61 last lap if they want to be in the medals here. Probably too much for them to go ahead and get that gold, but there is silver and bronze up for grabs. But I can't quite see it happening with the pacing at the moment unless we see a real drive from 300 metres out. So it's Caulfield and Xavier, 300 to go, moving together, running a strategic race, but probably not quick enough now to get in amongst the medals. So Xavier's taken the uh, ascendancy now. Is it too little too late though? Perhaps that running down the back straight just losing the time was ticking over there and the time now going close to 340 good running from Xavier but it won't be enough to get them in the medals so all three teams from that first time final will take gold silver and bronze but let's get behind Xavier as they come through to finish this off the 353 there the time for Wesley 339 Melbourne Grammar 345 and Halebury 346